Hello once again to my friends of the internet. Today we have an I have another tutorial for you guys. It is Matt from Boss Tutorials. Um I know my desktop isn't looking as organized as it usually does. <laughs> um in this tutorial I'm just going to be showing you how to download a multiplayer map if you will or uh world into your Minecraft server. So, what I've already done here, this is what you'll need to do. Just ignore all this stuff. Sorry guys. So I have this. It's the Tree of Wisdom. Uh, it's a highly rated one. I, I've i played it. I really suggest that you guys do it. It's pretty fun. Um, yeah. So if you want to download that, I will have a download link in the description for it. Anyways, once you download it, there will be a Tree of Wisdom dot RAR. So just ex well, get it on, drag it from your downloads to your desktop you're going to open it with better zip now if you don't have better zip that can be downloaded in the Mac App Store because this is a tutorial for Mac this will not work for Windows so in the Mac App Store well it might work for Windows but <laughs> yeah I'm showing you for Mac so in the Mac App Store it's uh, called better zip okay it'll open RARS so you can do that open it up now Okay, I have it open here. Whoopsies. Nope. <laughs> okay. So Tree of Wisdom version 0 0.1. So you have all this stuff in here. Okay. Now, if you look inside your server folder, so you should have a folder like this. To run your server, you go to start doc command. If you want a server, look at my previous tutorial. This will work for a bucket server. It will also, I'm pretty sure it will also work for a normal non bucket server such as this one see without a bucket in it this is the craft bucket jar so you have your server you might notice if there will be a server whoopsies one sec guys there we go okay so there will be inside this folder just ignore what I just did there there should be a folder called world right there see that see that world not too hard to find it might be closer to the top I just move things around alright so a server called world like that and if you open it you notice it has some of the same stuff right data level dot dat level dot dat old region session dot lock it has all that same stuff so what I'll do what I'm I'm gonna yeah, so first I'm going to go into here, into better zip, so click on the world and extract it to your desktop. Click extract here. Okay. Now, yours will still be named Tree of Wisdom version 0.1.rar. Just rename it to world on your desktop. Now, you're going to go back into your server folder get the world one and rename it to something that you'll rem whoops oh my gosh okay so you're gonna rename this to something that you'll remember so I'm just gonna yeah just randomly call it P that's fine okay move P onto my desktop there we go and I'll put world into this folder. Okay, now now that I've named it world, this is originally the tree of wisdom, uh, but I've renamed it world. So you have to do that. Make sure that it's world and it doesn't stay tree of wisdom. Now with this folder, since this is your old world with everything in it, all the stuff that you've been working on, etc, etc, you can rename it something like our world. Like that. Okay, and um, so it's been renamed Our World, just so you, that you remember that that's your old one. Okay, so now you have this one, and uh, that's pretty much it. It's, there's not too much to it, honestly. Um, so yeah, now you just run your server, let it get all started up. 
Now one thing that you might want to do if you are not allowing mods inside of it, you can I'll close the server. You move the plugins folder out of it. Then you do start dot command. And yep, it should work like that. Now there'll just be no plugins. Alright, so no no being able to cheat. And if you go into start dot command. Whoops, I already have it open. Sorry guys. So yeah, now the server's running. So uh Alright guys, so um now that the server is running, you can just do, do, open up Minecraft, log in, everything, multiplayer, join your server, and here I am. So this is the Tree of Wisdom, guys. This is a really cool one. I, I actually really like it. There's like that random floating sphere up there. And you just have to survive here. Um, if you go to the actual website, which there will be a link for in the description, they give you challenges. So challenge, build a house, build a farm, build all farm kinds, and some food. It says uh, build a cobblestone generator. See, so there's all these challenges, optional ones down here. Um, so yeah, this is, it, it shows you here, that's the spawn area, it's the tree. This is the portals to the nether. So, I think, I'm not quite sure, but I think that if you get to that other orb, then there are portals to the nether that you can go to. Something like that. Um, parkour. Who doesn't love parkour? So, yeah, this one's a lot of fun, guys. There's lots, though. If you just go search them up on Google or something, if you want this one, I said there will be a link for it. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.